TxDOT is working on a solution to reopen I-10 at the San Jacinto River. It has remained closed in both directions since barges hit the bridge following Imelda. A meeting is set for tonight. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez joining us now live with a preview from TxDOT headquarters. Kathy, good morning. Good morning to you. TxDOT right now is working on a plan that will help frustrated drivers in that area. They say that will take effect in the coming days. A traffic nightmare in East Harris County since Tropical Storm Imelda hit the region. The I-10 bridge over the San Jacinto River remains closed. TxDOT is working on a temporary fix to give drivers some relief. It's a matter of moving concrete barrier to, to separate traffic and also to get traffic moving. So if you're coming on, if you're going westbound on I-10, we're going to have to shift you over at some point to the eastbound side. So that takes concrete barrier, also some striping. So we're working on that now. Nine barges in the river broke loose from their moorings early Thursday morning. Two of the barges collided with the I-10 bridge. Officials say rushing currents and high winds caused it. Looking at inspections to, to determine what we're going to do with the bridge. And that's going to be the westbound bridge that took the uh, biggest impact. It was Sunday when crews finally removed the barges, but the freeway remains closed. We do thank everyone for their patience. Together we can get through this, but it's going to take some time to make sure we get this done correctly. And for now, they say give yourself plenty of time to get to your destination. The official detour is to take 146 to 225. TxDOT says they are still working to figure out exactly what it's going to take to permanently fix that bridge. Then they can secure a contractor and then start work. All of that will take some time, so just be patient. Reporting live at TxDOT headquarters, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.